there. It's me, Helio the Math Robot. I hope you're doing well. I roam around a lot, you know. That's why I need to keep myself charged with batteries and fill up some fuel for my RV. This means that I have to buy batteries and also some fuel. That is when I found out that to buy something, we need money to pay for it. It was a little difficult at first, but then I got used to it. At the time, I used to collect all my money in this piggy bank. Do you like it? Oh, <laughs> thanks! I'm sure that you must be having one as well. Today, I'm going to break it. Will you help me count the money I have in this piggy bank? Great! Always remember to be careful while doing such things, buddy. Let's break it down. Hey, we did it! Look, how much money we have! Oh, just looking at this collection makes me so happy. When I came to India, I learned that they count money in rupees and paise here. Rupees are the currency notes and their symbol looks like this. It has two lines on its head. While counting, we have to keep all of this in mind. So let's make sure we remember it. I have collected so many coins and notes. I have collected all the four coins. Look! This is the one rupee coin. It has one written on it. This is the two rupee coin. And it has two written on it. Every coin and note has a number written on it. This tells us the value of the coin and the note. Easy, right? Oh, look. This is the 10 rupee coin. It is the biggest in size. Can you tell me which coin is this? Did you know 5 rupees and 10 rupees are available in coins as well as notes? Look, these are all the notes of 5 rupees and 10 rupees. Other than these, there is a 20 rupees note, a 50 rupees note, and can you tell me which note this is? I have 4 coins of 5 rupees. 5 coins of 2 rupees and 1 coin each of 1 rupee and 10 rupees. I also have 2 notes each of 10 rupees and 20 rupees. Let's start by adding the 5 coins of 2 rupees. To count the money, we add forward. 2 plus 2 is 4. When we add another 2 to 4, we get 6. 6 plus 2 more is 8. And when we add 2 to that, we get the total value of 10. Ha! This is so easy! <laughs> Can you count and tell me the total number of the 4 coins of 5 rupees? We get 20 rupees by adding the 4 coins of 5 rupees each. We also got 10 rupees by adding the 5 coins of 2 rupees each. Besides this, we also have one 10 rupees coin and one rupee coin. We need to add them all together to find out how much money we have in the form of coins. Always start by adding the biggest amount first. 20 plus 10 is 30. When we add another 10 to 30, we get 40. Can you tell me what will be the total amount if we add 1 rupee to 40 rupees? That's right, we get 41 rupees. I can't wait to find out how much money I collected in my piggy bank. Now I am left with 2 notes each of 20 rupees and 10 rupees. Can you count and tell me the total amount we have in the form of notes? That is a lot of money! I have collected a total of 41 rupees in coins and 60 rupees in notes. I am so happy! 
Now I am going to go and buy myself something with this money. Thanks for helping me out. See you soon. Keep solving. <laughs>